Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with the brand new 2022-23 Panini Recon Basketball. Six box, half case, random team break number one. A lot of fun stuff here. All cards ship. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Appreciate it. All 30 teams are in. No combos. Let's roll it. Randomize names and teams three and a six, nine times each. One, two, three, four, five, six, no, he does not, Jimmy. Seven, eight, and nine. Three and a six, nine times for the teams. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Got rockets down to the Jazz. After nine. All right, Scott with the Rockets, Zachary with the Cavs, Jonathan with the Nuggets, Joe with the Nets and Suns, Frank with the Spurs, Stephen with the Mavericks, Matthew with the Sixers, Joe with the Pacers, Damon with the Timberwolves, Gabe with the Raptors, Joe with the Wizards, Justin with the Kings, Stephen with the Warriors and Celtics, Frank with the Pelicans, Joe with the Grizz, Simon with the Clippers, Scott with the Knicks, Fung with the Hornets, Robert with the Thunder, Frank with the Bucks, Joe with the Pistons, Last Ball Mojo, Damian with the Hawks, Kevin with the Bulls, Robert with the Magic, Robert Duvall is in the break, Robert Duvall with the Magic, Eric with my Lakers, Justin with the Heat, Steven with the Trailblazers, and Joe with the Jazz. All right, let's order these alphabetically. While you're considering trades, we're going to pop open this fresh case and we're going to see which six boxes we're going to do. And then we'll pause for a quick trade window. The trade window currently open. Steelers flags. What's going on on this street? Where's the, where's the love for the Seahawks? Clippers up for trade. All right, we'll roll the die. One, two, three for the left side. Four, five, six for the right side. Four, one, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll save these other six for next time. All right, we'll pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. And then we'll have the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back, everybody. No deals were done, so the list right here remains the same. Thanks, everyone, for watching, for breaking with us, for getting into it. Appreciate you. Let's see what we got in this recon. We're looking for the ultra rare hollow dots parallel. Am I going to know what that's? Are we going to know what that looks like as soon as I oh, see it? My guess is yes. Either way, good luck. Thanks everyone for making it happen. Rex was asking earlier, any sophomore QB predictions this year? Refresh my memory, who are the sophomore quarterbacks this year? Who were the quarterbacks last year? I don't know if they were that memorable last year. Actually, Desmond Ritter, I feel like, ended the season kind of on a high note. I'd like to see him play well. I don't know. Are they kind of doing a little luminance design right here? Kind of like that. Rock the rim. Jalen Duran. There's a Keegan Murray to 199. That's right. Kenny Pickett. I think he showed a lot of promise last year. Kevin Porter Jr. to 199 and a rookie autograph. That's Blake Wesley for the Spurs. 63 out of 99. Future Victor Wembanyama teammate, Frank, with the Spurs.
There's Harrison Barnes at 299. Tyrese Halliburton to 199. I think the sophomore QB projection for Malik Willis may not be very good. Unfortunately. But he might might get another shot somewhere if they if they end up trading him. There's Dalen Terry to 299 for the Bulls. Anthony Melton to 299 and your autograph is Kayvon Looney 46 out of 49 called to excellence autograph for the Warriors at Steve Olson the uh, the rebounding machine Kayvon Looney wasn't it Kayvon Looney who was getting like 20 rebounds a night in the playoffs or something like that Right, next box. Remember, uh, remember Luna Lovegood? From uh, Harry Potter, they called her Looney. Long time. It wasn't very nice, but that's what they called her. Kids can be mean. Are there patch autos in this? No, it doesn't. It doesn't say one way or the other. I guess there are draft night acetate signatures. Says on the other side of the box. They're mostly like this slightly heavier cardstock. Looks like 55 on the top loaders. Marcus Smart to 199. Clint Capella to 299. And for the Clippers, Musa Diabate, 14 out of 25, rookie auto for. Simon and the Clippers tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Looks like there can be patch assists, Scott. All right, thank you. Thank you. Sky is the limit for Zion Wilson. He just has to stay healthy. Come on, man. Stay healthy. There's Lugans Dort to 49. That's for the Thunder. That'll be for Robert. Lonzo Ball to 299. Just for the Bulls. There's a Chris Middleton to 99 for the Bucks. That will be for uh, Milwaukee. That's for Frank. Paolo Bancaro, 173 out of 299. I like this. This is for Robert and Orlando. Nice. And the autograph. We've got Destined for Greatness, 82 out of 99. That is Herbert Jones for the Pelicans. It's Frank with the Pels. I hope he's Destined for Greatness. Yeah, that, that he is still. Is he even twenty one? Is I even twenty one? So, I think that's why there's still a bit of a uh, bit of hope. Twenty two. Yeah, even though even though the stock is down on Zion. I think his his youth, I think, kind of gives him 
gives people a little, there's still a window of hope for, for him. But he's got, he's got to start turning things around in like the next, next season or two. RJ Barrett, two ninety nine. Is this the? This looks like hollow dots, right? Cam Reddish. Allegedly, it's ultra rare. This is for Portland. That's going to be for Steve Olson. Fox says it's ultra rare. RJ Barrett's two ninety nine, and Jabari Smith Jr. for the Rockets at two ninety nine. That is going to be for Scott. True Potential, autographed to 99, Trevor Keels. That's for the Knicks, Scott. Yeah, that's right. There were people that gave up on, on Otani. We were, I remember, you know, and myself included, because I remember in the shop, in our shop, we were selling Otani from his like rookie year out of Bowman Baseball or something like that, rookie Otani's graded PSA 10s for less than $100. Probably 50, 60 bucks a card, and we had a stack of them too. Here's a Chet Holmgren rookie card for OKC. That's for Robert. Now, oh, Robert got OKC and Orlando Magic. It's the draw. It's pretty good. There's Walker Kessler to 99. He had a nice season. There's Jimmy Harden to 299 and destined for greatness autograph. That is Kenyon Martin Jr. for the Rockets. 24 out of 99. I don't know how far Zion stock has fallen, but I don't know. If it's if it's low enough, there's got to be a point where people have to just start buying just to just to speculate, just to just to see what happens. All right, about another 10, 15 minutes to go on this one. We're halfway through the six box break. Brand new recon, random team one. We'll have some hoops tomorrow. We'll have another game of the Eastern Conference Finals. We'll see if the Miami Heat can close things out in Boston tomorrow night. So we'll be breaking and watching that together. Is this Alperin Sengun to 199? There's Chris Boucher to 299. And for the Timberwolves, Matt Ryan, 41 out of 99. He hit a clutch three for the Lakers early in the season that at the end of this by the end of the season kind of helped them uh, into the play and where they played the Timberwolves and then ultimately beat them on a nice little nice little run yeah the, I think that was uh, someone else did that too Zach Gallen and then I feel like another pitcher did that this week, maybe for the Guardians or something like that. Someone else did it. 
Yeah. Musa Diabate to 99. Bobby Portis to 199. And a Franz Wagner, 17 out of 75. Call to excellence autograph for uh, Robert and the Magic. Simone Fontecchio, 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 34 out of 299. There was a grounder that hit a bird too. Yeah, not, not, a, not a good time for birds. Sorry, birds. Yeah, what are they? I guess those odds shot up, yeah. Well, I think there's been, uh, at least in Southern California, there's been, there's been a lot more rain, which has meant a lot more, uh, you know, a lot more plant growth. It's kind of amazing. There's some parts of LA where it's just covered with like wildflowers, like in like empty fields and like parks and stuff like that. But um, but more more rain meant more plant life. More plant life meant more animals, more snakes, more rabbits, more more birds being born. So maybe there's more birds around the country, and they're just visiting these big, wide open ballparks, and they're like, "This seems like a good place to land." And then, oops, was it Will Brennan that hit a grounder and a bird was just sitting on the infield grounds? Remember last year's playoffs where a uh, the Dodgers and the Padres and a goose, giant goose, flew and f and just landed in the uh, infield. The Anthony Melton. And here's Kyrie Irving. To 299. Anthony Melton will be for the Sixers. That's for Matthew. And behind Dylan Brooks is is Andrew Nemhard, 37 out of 49. That's going to be for Indiana. Joe with the Pacers. We named the dog Indiana. You were named after the dog? I had a lot of fond memories of that dog. It's Paolo Bancaro. Indiana. Jeremy Grant to ninety-nine. Walker Kessler to two ninety-nine. Didn't Walker, didn't Walker Kessler get some uh, Rookie of the Year consideration? Some second, third place votes? Alonzo. Ooh, and here's one of these autographs that I really like the look of. There you go. Moses Moody, gold ink autograph, 9 out of 10 for Stephen Olsen and the Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Yeah, I think you're right, right? I don't think it's not surprising that squirrels end up in, in uh, in parks, in ballparks, all the snacks and peanuts and cracker jack laying around. There's a good rabbit hole that you can go down. Well, a cat hole, I guess that you can go down. Of uh, cats that end up on uh, cats that end up on, on on the field. 
specifically soccer fields. Pretty the, the, the animals are terrified. They, they don't know what they got themselves into. But, but from a human perspective, it's kind of amusing. I think there was a cat at a Liverpool match many years ago, and uh, dubbed the Anfield cat, I think was was ushered uh, off the field. I think I think a nice usher that was on the field kind of scooped him up under his arm. The cat wasn't really fighting. And they ended up going to some local adoption, animal adoption place and got adopted pretty quickly. All right. Got Chet Holmgren right here. This, uh, what, what is this? Rookie, rookie? Rookie card? It looks very psychedelic there. Yeah, I don't, mind, I don't mind the look of this at all either. Wasn't there a story of Dave the cat being adopted by John Stones? Doesn't surprise me. That the cats end up on the pitch a lot. I feel like that that should be a live stream, right? The 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 stadium, a ballpark at night, and see what kind of animals are wandering around in there. Out of forty nine, here's some Bones Highland. That's for Simon and the Clippers. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Fifteen out of forty nine. There is Santa Clara Jalen Williams for OKC. That's for Robert. The other Jalen Williams on that team is from Arkansas. I think. It's Kyrie to 299. I think Santa Clara Jalen Williams is the one that was drafted higher. Kendall Brown to 199 for the Pacers. There's Kyrie for the Mavs. That's to 299. Devin Vassell, future Victor Wenbanyama teammate. Is that a good thing for these for the guys like Devin Vassell? His rookie year wasn't too long ago. Rising tides lift all boats. Is Victor Wembanyama that rising tide? Could be. And a one of one. True potential one of one Nikola Jovic. Not not that not Nikola Jokic. This is Nikola Jovic. One of one. Miami Heat. Justin with Miami. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Nice. And what is this? World Traveler Rui Hachimura? This looks like it's a short print, isn't it? It's Kevin Durant. To one ninety nine, there you go. That's a way to make some money. You don't think those you don't think those professional sports teams make enough money off of us, Rex? I well, they should do it for free. Alright, here's a quick little recap. Nice recon break, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.